and welcome back to my channel. My name is Danielle. For those of you who do not know me, hi, welcome. I'm so glad you stopped by today. Today, we are doing my boxy charm unboxing. I'm not going to look in here because I don't want to know what's on it, but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna look. The only thing I know is this. I got a Laura Geller Baked Blush in Brighton. I do wanna open this though. I'm gonna swatch it, you guys. Oh, that's pretty. That is a really pretty blush. That is a really, really pretty blush. That is in Tropic Hues. I will tell prices at the end. I kind of want to go through and see what I got in the box before I do that. And I'm also going to try everything on. Ooh, brushes. These are from Alomar Cosmetics. So it looks like we got a blending brush, a very kind of flat brush. I'd probably use that for like putting eyeliner on if I'm just going to do like a line or even like stamping color close to my waterline. And then this very kind of like flat brush, which I would think would be very ideal for like a cut crease type of a thing. Then we got this Butter London Glazen Lustrous Liner in Disco. That's what that looks like. I love getting eyeliner. I'm gonna have to buy it. Ooh, okay, I'm excited about this one. This is from Hank and Henry. It actually goes that way. I, oh, that's cute. And it is a matte liquid lipstick. So it's actually a liquid, but look at how they made it kind of like it is a bullet lipstick. That's cute. And this is in Petal Pusher. We are definitely going to swatch this. Ooh, look at the doe foot. Let's swatch it. That is a gorgeous color. I'm super excited about that. Cute. I really like that. I like the color too. And then we have this palette. This is the Nightingale palette by Pretty Vulgar. Take that thing off of there. And this is what that looks like. It is a very neutral palette, but it's kind of like the darker side of things. I am excited to play with this. But really quick before I do that, let's get into the prices. So the Nightingale palette is $35. The Laura Geller blush is $28. The three brushes from Alomar Cosmetics are $18. The Hank and Henry liquid lipstick is $17. And then this Butter London Glazing Lustrous Liner is $19. So, really quick, that. I think that comes to $117 for this box, which is a pretty decent value. Okay, are you guys ready to watch me play with this stuff? I'm super excited. We're gonna try out the brushes, we're gonna, everything. We're going. We're going there. The first thing I want to do is go ahead and put on a primer of some kind. Well, this is what I use. The LA Girl Pro Conceal. And then I'm going to take this shade here, Nocturnal, and I'm just going to set that. I'm going to start out with the shade Hide and Seek right here. And I'm going to use this Alomar blending brush. So right off the bat, this is a very kind of floppy blending brush. Works better with windshield wiper motions. My husband's gonna like this palette. 
because he likes the kind of smoky eye look. Then I'm going to go in with the shade Flip Out right here. These blend very well so far. Well, the two shades I've used. Okay, I'm gonna go back in with that Hide and Seek shade on the Alamar brush and just kind of blend. I'm gonna go in with a swoop right here and just put that on the outer edge. Really kind of deepen that. Okay. And then I'm going to go in with the shade I Spy right there. And I'm going to use this flat brush. Then I'm going to take the eyeliner I got. It does say shake. So we're going to shake. Let's see how this is. It's more like the felt tip thing than an actual brush. Sometimes these work out really nice, sometimes they don't. It was a very nice wing. Okay. That worked out rather well. I'm just gonna put on some mascara. This is just that Santi one I used the other day. Okay, I'm gonna go in with, I'm gonna use this Alamar Cosmetics brush and then I'm going to go in with All Nighter right there. And I'm going to put this on my lower lash line. So I'm just gonna use it to kind of like stamp it on. Ooh, I really like this for this already. I mean, of course I will have to try it out more, but this first go around's working out pretty well. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with that Laura Geller Baked Blush here. Ooh, that's pretty. Went in a little heavy on that side. <laughs> I'm blushing. That's a pretty blush though. That's really pretty. Okay, now we're going to try out the Hank and Henry liquid lipstick. I'm excited about this liquid lipstick. It is a beautiful shade. What is that? What does it smell like? Butterscotch? I don't know. It smells like butterscotch, I think. I actually like this doe foot. The real test is up here though. Well, there you have it. I tried everything in my BoxyCharm this month, and I am 
pretty happy with everything that is in this month's BoxyCharm. Let me know what you guys got down below. Did you like what you got in this month's BoxyCharm? Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a like and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. I do have a giveaway going on currently. It runs until October 8th. And it will be linked down below if you want to check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I do hope you have a wonderful day, night, wherever you are, and bye!